After U.S. stocks opened up the new trading session in the week well in the down, even managing to see the Dow Jones drop more than a thousand points earlier this morning, the afternoon trading session has seen a reversal of sorts, no not into positive territory, but the Dow Jones right now a down just about 110, 120 points during these afternoon hours following the renewed rout in the global markets, continuing to come under severe pressure from continued fears of slowing growth in China's economy. Now, the Dow Jones Industrial Average last trading down about 130 points this afternoon with a few more hours left of trade. Meanwhile, in the Forex market, we do have the U.S. dollar continuing to remain strongly bullish this afternoon. We first begin with the Euro-U.S. dollar pair 1.77% higher at a read of 115.78. Moving on to the British pound to U.S. dollar pair, that's 0.31% higher at a read of 157.33. And we also have the U.S. dollar Japanese yen pair 2.73% lower, 118.62 yen. Trading central analysts in the afternoon session still focused on the U.S. dollar, Australian dollar, U.S. dollar pair that is, as the pair has hit two targets at 0.72 and 0.7175 while remaining on the downside. Short positions below the resistance at 0.7280 are favored, with new targets at 0.7070 and 0.7010 in extension. Moving on to precious metals, we continue to see mixed trade. We first take a look at gold, which is in focus, as gold has hit two targets at 1165.50 and 1168.30 in extension, while still remaining on the upside. Long positions above the resistance at 1149 are favored, with up targets at 1168 and 1173 in extension. Now we conclude with silver prices this afternoon, 4.19% lower at a rate of $14.70 a troy ounce. And don't forget to follow Trading Central on Twitter at Trading Central for all of your Forex market updates. And for Trading Central Web TV from the floor of the New York Stock Exchange on a Monday afternoon, I'm James Swinney.